Christmas pillows. Santa Claus. I love that one. Traditional Christmas Russian dance. All of our decorations out from downstairs. We're about to put the tree up. We use an artificial one. We got it started here. <laughs> you know how that goes? I think we're going to need a. <laughs> Probably even more than we need. I think we got this last year because our other one, it didn't light up and we wanted one to light up. So we got this one. Hopefully it'll light this year. We just tested two strings of light and they were both dead. I make these little gingerbread boys and then I wrap them in a um, the plastic wrap and put little strings in between. I made this. This is just a dowel stick that I painted and put two knobs from the hobby store on the end. And there's scissors for guests. You can cut one off when they leave. And it's just a little, a little treat for visitors. The children, when they come and visit. Can you start painting? Mm-hmm. This doesn't hold that much, but it's so cute. This is really great. Kids love this one. Looks like Santa Claus. Mm -hmm. Is there another hook? Yep, there's one more hook. One year we found this Christmas moose because Bob is a Canadian born in Edmonton, Alberta. And they have a lot of moose up there. So we found this stuff moose. I don't think we'll keep it there the whole time, but just for now. Special Christmas pillows. These are fascinating womanhood pillows. 
that we got. You can get these if you like from Redbubble. This one is the Fascinating Girl one. Collecting um, Christmas tree ornaments for a lot of years as I've pulled. So some of these I'll show you as we put them on are original from when we were first married. Because we didn't have any Christmas decorations when we were first married. And I we were poor students, so I made some of salt dough. And you can too, if you need to, because they're fun and kids love to make them. Hardly any of them have survived, but when as we pull them out, I'll show you like this one. This is just salt dough. And then you paint it and it's and you can varnish it and it's it's really fun. And um, like I said, kids can do it. You may want to save one for years with your children. Well here's another homemade one. There's a few that survived all these years, but some of these I bought and so what I did after I had enough barely, I started buying a nice ornament one per year so I gradually got some nicer oops some nicer ones like this and even if it was um, and I always got them on sale this is Captain Hook from Peter from Peter Pan Disney and that survived I love that one oh you know what I think it's Rapunzel See your hair? I think it's Rapunzel. Some of these are gifts from friends. Like this one. Some people put them on a gift and they put them on the top. Then I keep it to remember them by. <laughs> Tons of Christmas tree ornaments. A donut. Santa Claus. This is the butler I made years ago. He always serves candy. He's not here just for Christmas, but he always serves candy. Every time of the year, and everybody gets to eat the candy when they come in. We're just waiting for them to finish putting on the lights and then we will put on the ornaments. That's the fun part. I'll put this nativity. We have two nativities. This is the little one that goes on the mantle. This is a picture of my mother when she was dating my father. And she wrote, with love, Helen on it. It's to him, to my father. Oh, I think it says a date on here. 1940, they weren't married yet. The other one is it. I want to that. Next time we put this on the mantle. Way. This is our sandwich. We couldn't put it up without him. And our dear daughter-in-law is filming. <laughs> I think we're ready, aren't we, for the, the decorations? Yes. Pop? We're ready for decorations. Uh, this is the fun part. There they are. Tons of them. Do you guys want to here start? Here we go. Okay, the, here we go. Let's couple? see here. I like donuts. I'll try that one. <laughs> that looks edible. I like this one. You can tell which ones I picked out. 
It's a fairy. I'm kind of a fairy. It's one of the ones I got one in a year. This is the Captain Hook I showed you before. And this is a princess. Are they friends? Yeah, I think they'd be friends. He looks a little dangerous, though. So. <laughs> Princess Ballerina. Just has ribbons to hold them up. I love this one. What is this? Not crackers. Not crackers. This one here is the oldest one from college days. Still survives. I keep pointing these out because you can make these. And they're fun. This one has sparkly glitter on it. You can do that too. The key to salt those, don't make them too thick because they get heavier the thicker they are. And they can kind of weigh down the tree. There's an angel with one wing. Oh, well, that's nice. Put it in the back. <laughs> I'll put it on the side so Nobody will see far it. enough to be. Traditional Christmas Russian dance. Out of space. So here's one. The big nativity scene and it has a lot more pieces. Oh, hand is broken. One broken hand. Mayor looks sad with your broken. I know. I have to fix her. Now for the blue. This 
It is amazing. When I discovered this, it glues so good. So many things. Now, it doesn't glue instantly like super glue, but it glues pretty fast. It's really strong. E6000. <laughs> it's not coming out. When it first you first open it, it it goes all over. You can't hardly stop it, and then it kind of. Even though I put the lid on really good. Do you need some help? Yeah, I need a lot of. Great. Okay. Now. There we go. I'm putting this one on the garage door because I made my garage look like a little cottage and so everything I put on it has to be kind of small. This was for Halloween. So I made this look like a, it's rounded but it actually isn't. It's a regular door that I just made look like that. The garage entrance is the ugliest entrance in the house. And so I wanted it to be more pretty. Now, I, I need to put some Christmas flowers in here. I didn't do that. I, I will do that soon. These are real. If this is um, faux, these are real. This painting is faux. These steps are made out of wood, but I made them look like they're out of stones. Some of the tiles there are real and some of them are not. Okay. That's kind of fancy. This was not bought at the Halloween store. I think it looks natural. <laughs> oh! Well, we already have glasses. Well, let's use those. Use they're, they're more Christmas and they're gold. And... Those are antiques that he did. Yeah. I'll put them down on his knees. England. It's genuine English pottery. My Fifty-one. Yes, 
to Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> Um, well, you do the most of that, so yeah. of course you've been doing it online, yeah, which is sure. kind of cool. Thanks everybody for joining us for this, our very first vlog style video. I gotta apologize, I think some of the sound wasn't so hot. We don't really totally have it all figured out yet how to do these. We'll do better next time. Right. <laughs> <laughs> and if you like our videos, don't forget to like and subscribe because it really helps our channel to grow. Check out down below for our books, uh, workbooks, they can really help make your marriage and your relationships so much better. Thanks again for joining us. Hope you have an incredible Christmas and a great New Year. We hope you have a really Merry Christmas and uh, take care. <laughs>